The DeWalt 20 volt XR oscillating tool has been the king of the jungle for a long time. But I'm here to tell you, there's a new sheriff in town. The brand new M12 Milwaukee oscillating tool is better than the DeWalt in almost every single phase. Let's take a look. The ergonomics on the new Milwaukee are just a classic oscillating tool shape. You've got the barrel shape that you can get into any number of positions. When you're doing a cut that goes back and forth, you can easily move your hand back and forth and back and forth. Say you're doing a long, deep cut. There's a reason why oscillating tools are this shape, because you use them in a variety of different ways. You don't want to outsmart yourself and start making a tool that has all kinds of levers and bumps and different angles that just make it very confusing to use. It seems like this tool was designed by somebody that watched an oscillating tool video one time. They saw a person using the machine like this and they thought, oh, we can improve that. Let's make this a nice little hand grip unit. So the DeWalt is not ergonomically sound whatsoever. It feels great holding it like this in a certain cut. If you're doing one cut right here, right at kind of like waist level, it's quite nice. But the moment you start having to get this thing into different positions, it's cumbersome. Yeah, let's say for example, you're cutting a plug out, a plug hole inside of a cabinet. You're gonna need to hold the tool like this, like this, like this, and like this. No problem with the Milwaukee. With the DeWalt, you're holding like this. Now you gotta go like this. You gotta move your hand over like that. Come around here and come around there. It's just cumbersome. This is not a well-designed tool by any means. It's a classic DeWalt design. It almost seems like sometimes the DeWalt designers have never actually used a tool in a real life circumstance. Yeah, not necessarily ergonomics, but having this thing in your hand, the vibration control on the new Milwaukee is staggering. It is, like it's crazy. If you use this tool and you're making say a long cut, so you're going through double ply cabinet material, this thing will vibrate the heck out of your hand. Like if you hold the two units in your hand, both running. The difference between these two is staggering. <laughs> so without question, the new M12 Milwaukee is infinitely more ergonomic than the DeWalt. Cut speed, which cuts faster? In order to figure that out, we've got two tests. I put the exact same blade on both the units, so we'll cut through this black walnut L, two cuts each, then we'll put on a metal blade and we'll cut through five 15 gauge finish nails and we'll see which cuts faster. So you can see what the old Milwaukee can do. It can cut about 10% faster than the DeWalt. Very nice. Let's talk toolless blade change. Now I've seen a number of people online that are saying that the DeWalt is still superior and they wish that the new Milwaukee had a similar type system. Do they? Do they really? Let's look at this. So the DeWalt blade change system is pretty awesome. I'm not gonna knock it. It's got this little lever down here that you just depress, pull the blade off, pop a new blade on, let it go, clicks in. Jesus, the switch, the switch, the switch can be dangerous. You can lock that off, probably a smart thing to do. So yeah, you wanna change your position, undo it. Change the position, click it on. Super handy, very quick. There's a couple drawbacks with the DeWalt system. Let's say you want to use some Starlock blades. Why would you want to use one of these blades? Well, in the Starlock system with the Fine and the Bosch blades, they make some awesome blades, carbide tips, rounded fronts, 
Um, you just have a lot more blade options if, if you can put these Starlock blades on your machine. Now, if you want to use these blades on the DeWalt, you can. DeWalt provides this great little nut system. It's not great, it's terrible. Um, you have to use a wrench, so it's not toolless anymore. And then the blade basically mounts onto these little ribs here, and it just, it's sloppy. I'll show you what that's like on here. So you put that little clip on there, then you can put your Starlock blade on like so. And then you're, you're all the way back to square one here, and this mechanism is not great at all. So yeah, once you get that all the way in there, tighten that down. I mean, I don't know. It can slip around. Like when you're making a cut, this thing can come loose and slip around. It's kind of the classical problem with the original find before they went to the Starlock, is after use, the thing just comes loose and then you gotta tighten it back up get back into your cut. So yeah, I wouldn't, I would never bother with this star locks on here. I mean, it's not a huge deal to just keep on getting the quick change blades. Um, so yeah, when you're looking at the M12, yeah, you have to loosen this nut, which a lot of people online are complaining about, but really it doesn't take that much longer. Spin the nut two times, pop on another blade. It's got the magnet on here so it holds the blade nice and secure while you're putting the nut on. I mean that is not that much different than here. And yeah, if you want to put some of these high quality um, Starlock blades that you can get from Fine, Bosch and other companies, you don't need any tools. You do have to spin the nut out all the way. Pop this on there, fits on beautifully, sits nice and flat on there onto the plate. And then you just pop the nut back in there. Yeah, it's a, you know, whatever. It takes 15 seconds. Lock it back into place. So yeah, you can use any blade on this Milwaukee Toolless blade change. So is the DeWalt blade change that much quicker? Let's find out. Let's do three blade changes with each of the machines. We'll time it and we'll see just how much time you would save with this little lever action over the Milwaukee. So the DeWalt blade change system is slightly faster. The Milwaukee is more versatile. You can put on the Starlock blades and it doesn't detract at all whatsoever from the ergonomics. I'm gonna give the slight edge to Milwaukee. In my opinion, the new M12 Milwaukee is the new heavyweight champion. And give this little son of a bucket a poke in the eye down here. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next video.